Hi everyone, welcome back to Melissa's Corner. If it's your first time here, welcome. I'm so happy to have you. I hope that if you enjoyed the channel, that you might like, subscribe, leave me a comment down below. I will also list my email and my Instagram account down in this box underneath here if you wanna contact me that way. Well, today you can, you'll can you notice we have a little bit different setup. I added another shelf unit on the other side of the room where I usually sit. So now I have these two shelves here. I have a shelf over here. I have a shelf over here. And then my usual stuff over there. Um, I'd move the camera around, but I've got it stationary right now. So we're just going to leave it be for the time being. But this is a really tall shelf. It goes all the way up, all the way down. It has how many shelves? One, two, three, four. It has six shelves each each one so um, I reorganized and moved everything around which is kind of nice I you know what if I don't see it I won't use it so this is my new thing they will be out they will be seen they will be used and if they if, if they just have lost that love and feeling then it's time for them to move on but other than that I'm pretty much digging right now the things that I have. Um, there's a couple of things that I am willing to part with and probably will, but that's a whole nother topic. You say, hey lady, move on, get to the point. Well, today's video, let's go ahead and get going on. My bag of the day, it has been pretty much my bag of the week, which is my Polen numero un. I love this bag, I cannot tell you how much I love this bag and how much she holds. Um, this is one of my top favorite bags. It is, it just made the list. Well, I've had a lot of people contact me with interest on the Damaliers of London, which I have my Damaliers of London right here. I have one down on a lower shelf, but for the main part, the leather ones are here. This is the Midi Montreal. Um, that I got from uh, Harrods of London is where I ordered this one. And people, you guys, people, my friends, my YouTube watchers want to know how this one's different from the Nano because the Nanos are so cute and they look just alike. This one is just, it's more roomy, it's more comfy. If you don't carry a whole lot, the other size would probably suit you. But this, this is the one for me. So I'm going to share with you what fits in my Midi to Montreal. I don't know if you'd really call this a tote, but it's the Midi Montreal. And this one is in the color, I believe. I want to make sure that I'm telling you the color correct. I have the paperwork right here. This one is in the color. Does it not tell me? tells me what I ordered. I believe this is the toffee. This is the toffee color um, that I ordered. And I did get this, as I said, from Harrods of London. And she was $424.66. So less than 500 for this beautiful bag. And they're a wonderful company. Do your research on it. They give back. They support um, low income third world countries with immunizations for kids and I really like that I've said that before I love organizations that give back so this is one of those bags <clears throat> excuse me my voice is going but I'm going to give you some measurements of this bag since we're right here she has feet four feet and her width she is five inches in width her length is 10 inches in length, and her height is seven inches. Now, this little top notch handle, this has had the most questions about, um, if you can put your hand through here. If you have really teeny tiny hands, small arms, you probably can. But this is only a, two and a half inch drop. It's not gonna work for me. Well, okay, I can get my hand in, but it's, it's, you know, it's not going on the crook of my arm. It's not 
going anywhere besides over the fingers. Um, so for most people, that's not gonna be an option. So it'll be top carry. There is a handle that attaches to these little back attached D-rings to carry over the shoulder crossbody. So the hardware on this is so gorgeous. So gorgeous, absolutely just easy, easy open, easy peasy. You push this little portion on the bottom and it just pops open. So it does have a, a mechanism that catches it. It's not magnetic. It actually locks in. So once it's locked in, it's not going anywhere. Beautiful hardware up here at the top. Now I have a lot of tissue in here. So I'm gonna just pull that out right now. And I always store the straps inside the bag so I'm not going hunting for the straps. Um, and we'll take a look at this at the end. But let's see what fits into this bag. She is one open compartment. And I love that because when you have that center divider, that zip, that takes up room. It limits what you can put in. I mean, from versus sizes of wallets and things like that. So let's take a look at what she holds. I've got my um, pollen right here and we'll take the items out of the pollen and see what we can get in this bag right here. All right, I have been carrying my, it's a, it's a small wallet, but it is, you can see it's a little bit thick right there. This is my Jimmy Choo. Um, that I just purchased not too long ago. Love this wallet, it is so comfortable and easy to carry that she's hard to move out of. But let's see how this works. We're gonna stick in the Jimmy Choo wallet. Um, things that I have to have. I have to have my readers, my readers are going in. Uh, let's see what else I carry. This is a little um, Aspinall of London. You can see the size of this. This is just a little zip leather pouch that I put lots of things in, like my Tylenol, my tummy medicine, um, my lippies, my mirror, things like that I'll throw in here. Let's see how she fits. And she goes in just fine. Other than that, let's see, I would have my keys. I do like to carry a hairbrush, just a little tiny, small hairbrush. Sorry for all the hair in it. Just shows it's been used and it's loved, yes. And if I have room in a bag, I will stick maybe one more pouch in there. And I'll tell you, for me to put this pouch into this bag, I would probably have to compromise on the wallet and do a card case. So. Let's see how that works. If I take out this wallet and this pouch, I can pop right in here. No problem whatsoever. You can see I have my glasses, my brush, both of those two pouches that have a lot of stuff in there. And then if I wasn't carrying that wallet, I would need to have a card case. So. Hold for just a moment. I'm gonna grab one, got one from the shelf right over here. This is just a Tory Burch um, ID zipper case. Let's see how this works. This, I can pop. Oh yeah, perfect. Slips right inside. And I would still have room for my six key, um, key fob put in here. And let's see if she shuts. Because if you can get it to the mechanism, oh, you have to squish from the top, of course, because that's where she folds. And no problem. No problem at all. I have all of that in this bag. So the strap I've had questions on also. This is one of those push tab type of straps. Um, it has lots of holes to be able to adjust. I have not really played with the adjustment of this because I have used it mainly as a hand carry and a um, shoulder carry. So I'm just gonna show you real quick this bag with the straps attached. So right now, 
perfect for a shoulder carry. Would not, I'll stand up. It will not work right now for me as a crossbody. I would have to let it down because you can see if I put it on. Well, you know, it's not too bad. I would maybe take it down one to get it to be the perfect crossbody for me, but that's really not too shabby. So this bag, I absolutely love. Um, if you don't carry a whole lot, you can go for the Nano, but for me, this size is wonderful. Pops open real easy. And again, right there, have access to all my goods. There is a back zip pocket if you care to use. Um, I do sometimes, not all the time, but I wanted to share this with you guys because I have been getting so many questions on this bag. So um, if you're interested in one, take a look online. These are gorgeous, beautiful bags. I'm gonna take out all this stuff right here just to show you one more time. There she is on the inside empty. Oh, and she has this uh, slip pocket right here on the front if you wanted to put your cell phone or something in because there is nothing on the back for your cell phone. So that's just a real quick video of what fits in the midi Montreal from Harrods, Harrods in London. That's all I've got for you today. Please remember to like, subscribe, leave me a comment, and I'll see you guys in my next video.